Hello and welcome, this is S tier rank. Today we'll be picking up where we left off on Psychonauts 2. Let's jump in. Okay, well we just saw Raz's family, so now I think we're gonna run out to uh, meet Elm somewhere. Let's see. Now we got a lot of stuff to do actually. Ah, okay. Somewhere in the questionable area. So there's a psycho isolation chamber. Ah, there's a bit laboratory. <laughs> and, uh, let's see. I wonder where that takes me. Maybe it's just to another level. I guess we'll go to autos first. Maybe it'll be great to start there and get a spare brain. It's exhausting getting around from place to place. Imagine if you had to jump and double jump everywhere in this world. Scanning for thinker print. Access granted. That's a crazy door. I love it. Nice to see you again, Rasputin. And you've managed to stay clothed. Very good. Wow. Look at all these gadgets. Gadgets? Sorry. Machines. Psycho-reactive technology? Rasputin, I thought you would recognize these for what they are. These are dreams. Where do you think machines come from? They spring forth from the human imagination. They are human thought made real. I invented that one when I was angry. When I designed that one, I was sad. <laughs> that one, uh, I was just hungry. Incredible. Glad you like them. You know, I'm not supposed to check out equipment to interns, but Agent 9 seems to put a lot of faith in you, my boy. So, if you'd like to try one out, just let me know. Cool. Oh, what are we gonna get? Agent Mentalis? Uh, yes, Rasputin? Got any cool devices to lend out? Shh. Interns aren't allowed to check out my devices. But if you were to take your time, say, delivering one of these to Sasha or Mia, well, that would be none of my business. This one is a thought tuner. Use it to find stray thoughts floating around the world. And this psi enhanced camera is for creating photographic memories. I'd train you how to use them, but uh, that would only increase my legal liability. Have fun. Ah, okay. Let's see. And thanks for delivering those items to Sasha and Mia. What's your theory on the mole? Oh, uh, I really haven't thought too much about it. Maybe I should make a lie detector. So is Maligula as bad as people say? Oh, I don't like to think about that name. If my device had just worked better that day, so many things would be different now. What device did you build to fight Maligula? The Hyper High Glaciator. It amplified our hydrokinetic powers and allowed us to freeze water semi-permanently. But Maligula threw our friend Helmet in the water just before the device went off. He was frozen so deeply in my hyper ice, we were never able to recover his body. Only Ford saw it happen, and he is unable to tell us where to look for it. How do these machines make contact with your mind? The secret is the Citanium. 
It's a psychoreactive quartz-like mineral that responds to and amplifies psychic energy. It vibrates with the psychic waves, driving the machines. Well, I ought to let you get back to work. <laughs> very, very <laughs> humorous. Okay, let's see if there are any straight thoughts around. Hmm. Interesting. I wonder what uh, these stray thoughts will do if we find one. It really slows down your running around. Let's see what the other item does. Uh, okay. So it's just a camera. Okay, well, that's interesting, but I'm more that curious. Making my ears hot. What uh, this other one will be used for? Maybe we'll use it when we get back to a more populated area. Now this is. Voluntarily donated upon death. I have all the paperwork uh, somewhere. These people are all dead? Uh, their bodies are, and their brains are no longer capable of thought. But I've preserved them here, in the brain frame. What for? Experiments. Ew. Really? No room for the squeamish in psychic science, Sonny. The mind is the final frontier of humanity. We've only begun to explore its mysteries. That is, after all, the true mission of the Psychonauts. Someday, my brain will live here, and yours too. What? Should have read that NDA more carefully. Hmm, what are the chances this has something to do with the bad guy? Jeez. Damaged. Doll collecting. <laughs> so what is this about? Hmm. Why'd they even save this one? Wonder if these are uh, people that contributed to the game somehow. Don't like the undulations. Hmm. No. Hey, this one looks not bad. Not bad at all. Oh, okay. Don't know what that's about exactly. I have to look that up. Yeah. Approved hazing rituals for new agents. <sighs> Some things never change, I guess. Ah, uh, I think that's one of the items that uh, they asked me to pick up for the side missions. Yeah, have I? Yeah, I don't think I can at least. I think we'll that work though. See how the fire lingered around on the fan blade. Looks like there may be something I can jump up higher to. Maybe not. Oh, there's a platform up there. I wonder. Let's see. I feel like there's gotta be some way up to this. I just keep looking a little bit longer. Yep. Yeah, looks like gears are out. Oh, you gotta grind, cool. Okay. 
something else. Looks like that might be about it. That's cool. I'm glad he has a shortcut to him so I don't have to go all the way back over every time. I'm getting the sense there are some stray thoughts nearby. I should check it out with my thought to him. Thoughts! Straight thoughts! Ah, here we go. Cool. So let's see, uh, need to equip our middle connection. Totally forgot that these are called straight thoughts. I've got enough credit to upgrade one of my side powers. Well, that was cool. So you can jump back here, or is this just death? Actually, it looks like there's a little area back here. I'm hitting an invisible wall. I came out here looking for something. What was it? Oh, right, a brain for Nick, so I can get in to see Ford and to keep Nick from getting his head caught in the stamper again. Oh, oh yeah. See, is that Otto that had that? Ah, uh, okay, so that's what the brains are for. I gotta pay greater attention. Let's go back in. Here we go. I do like this game is a little bit more freeform than some other games. There's not so much handled and you've gotta kinda of figure stuff out, you know. It's awesome. Hey, this one looks not bad. Not bad at all. Probably been a long time since you've had a visitor. We hope you don't mind poppins. <laughs> Here we go. Hmm. Maybe I'm too late. Doesn't seem to be any life left here. Oh, hello. Can you hear me? My name is Raz. Who are you? How long have you been in here? What's your name? Sorry. Oh, you. Sorry, I just haven't talked in such a long time. Oh my gosh, is that my voice? Is that what I sound like? What do you sound like? Oh my gosh, who are you? Are you not me? My name is Raz. Words. Words. You're saying words to me? <laughs> what was that non-word sound I just made? Am I dying? No, not dying. I feel alive. Very alive. Who are you? Who am I? Am I anything? Am I everything? Am I God? Oh, I'm not sure, but I feel like I might be God. Or the universe. <laughs> or the ultimate cosmic oneness. Or something in that jam. Am I right? Well... Basically, right now, you're kind of a brain in a jar. Uh huh? But if you can remember your name, we might be able to find out what happened to your body. I can't remember much of anything. Hmm. I believe you are suffering from extreme sensory deprivation. Years with no physical input has caused your memory and identity complexes to atrophy. Oh, I am not ready for words that big yet. I happen to know of a body that needs a brain right now to keep it out of trouble. If I were to place you in that body, you would start to receive fresh sensory input, which could trigger some of your lost memories. Let's do it! Wait, what's a body? Aren't we all one? I'll be right back. What? <laughs> Where can you go? This is everything! I promise to be quick. While I'm gone, you try to remember stuff. Okay, but please hurry. I'll try to remember when I created the universe, or when I destroyed it. Brain definitely has an ego. Oh, jeez. If I put this brain into Nick's body, I think I'd be helping them both out. 
as well as helping me to get into the mail clerk's private office. Come with me, handsome. Have brain, will travel. Back to the mail room to put it in Nick's head. I do think I'd like to go meet the family um, in the questionable area. It'd be cool. So I might do that first. I yep. um, don't know where this is going to be exactly, but we'll go look, um, across with the uh, little platforms outside. And there is a psycho isolation chamber, but also with like there is something with um, some like air pot like cyclones I can hop up into. Maybe that would lead me to a new area. So let's see if that's the case. I see a card flying around over there. I don't know if I'll be my way over there. Okay, let's see. I think this is the area I'm gonna check out. There you go. And that area over there looks a little questionable. What's that over there? <laughs> Oh yeah. People might Looking for this little. Oh, where is it? But I think it's cool. Ha, ha. There we there go. Are some nice. Oh wow. Yep. It's pretty elaborate. Crazy. I already feel like this is a pretty big expansion over uh, the previous Psychonauts as far as the uh, overworld goes. There's Lily. Hi, Lily. You here to take me into custody? I'm sorry about that note. You don't have to apologize. I'm the one who's sorry. I'm just sensitive because I am guilty. Guilty of what? I'm guilty of being a terrible daughter. I've been a jerk to my dad all year. And now I might never... I might never talk to him again. You'll talk to him again. How can you be so sure, Raz? My psychic senses tell me so. My psychic senses tell me that something is really wrong with him. I've been reaching out and reaching out, and he's just not there. Anything I can do to help? Well, actually, there is something I need. Just name it. There is a very special fungus that only grows in damp parts of the questionable area. Say no more. I'm on it. Thanks, Raz. Okay, I guess I got a Hi, couple Lily. good reasons together now. Hey. Oh, didn't mean to talk I'll to you. I'll check in with you later, alright? Don't. There we go. Give me my goodies. Okay. Anything else up here? Oh, it looks like I had a rail to ground. Yeah. Oh, that takes me away, I didn't want to go. Okay, let's go see what's over here. Cool. Okay. Hmm. This area looks a little questionable. Something up there to collect. What's this? It's looking really creepy. Oh, looks like I had to grab on that ledge. There we go. Hmm. 
Here we go. Well, this thing is sharp. Mentally. Okay, cool. I think this is another one of the scavenger hunt items, I would suppose. Yeah, cool. There he's really uh, foreboding. Oh, it's all happy again. Music change. It's bright, beautiful. <laughs> it's like a spy closet or a spy locker up there. There's so much to see and do. Oh, there's a card. Looks like I can climb back. It's a cliff. Side card. There we go. Ah. Sweet. Filling up my uh, bag with this faster than I thought I could. Yep. other stuff on this side too. Treehouse over there. Oh, and then key, sweet. Man, so many collectibles in this game. It's crazy. I don't think I could easily get over there. It looks like I could jump down to this little island area. I wonder if that's a questionable area. see a path to anything. There's that water everywhere. Everywhere. Okay. Hmm. Look at this radio sound is. So like somebody's having a party up in the treehouse. Gisu, this is amazing! Coach was trying to throw it out, but I knew it was fixable. With this transmitter, KLOB will finally be on the air. Bob. No, K Loeb. We enrobe the mother load with music. Cool. So where are your records? Well, I only have one right now. What? Hey, we gotta start <laughs> somewhere. If I find any, I'll bring you more. I'm counting on it, partner. Let's Hey guys! Uh, busted! Now we gotta burn this site and find a new base of operations. What? Pirate radio, Gisu. Gotta be ready to bug out in 30 seconds flat if you feel the heat around the corner. Relax, Morris. I'm not a narc. Exactly what a narc would say. Where'd you get the radio? Gisu fixed up Coach's old transmitter and made it more powerful. Just be careful you don't fall asleep on that broadcast your dreams out to the world. Who would ever be dumb enough to do that? Meh. Do you know where the psycho-isolation chamber is? Ooh, are you trying to steal Lizzie's mentor, Compton Bull? No. So you're happy with Nick from the mailroom? Of course. <laughs> Everybody loves Nick. <laughs> so why a radio station, Morris? Shouldn't you be working with Mia? Mia wants me to learn how to reach out into the world. And this is how I'm gonna do it. 
interview with radio. Have you told her about this yet? No, I'm waiting until we get back our first ratings report so I can show her how effective it is. Okay, I need to go report my findings to the radio police. Ha <laughs> ha. Anyway, our fans come for the music. But hey, Gisu. Disputing the Quado. Say, you seem like the reckless and resourceful type. I have a challenge that I think is perfect for a young man of your disposition. Uh oh. Interested? Whatever it is, I'm into it. Wow, even more reckless than I thought. Impressive. Here's the issue. My mentor, Otto Mentalis, deployed several psycho seismometers like this one to detect and collect negative psychic residue. Problem is, he kind of forgot about them for a long time. So now, they're all overloaded and unstable. I thought, instead of me going around venting all these nasty things and stealing all the glory... You want me to do it? For extra credit, you're welcome. And to free me up for more high-minded engineering work. Okay. Come on, Rep. Wait, you said yes? All right, good man! <laughs> <laughs> well, if you survive, be sure to report back, okay? Like who? Like me. Huh. Hmm, I wonder how many these are. 23 of them. Quarry K's questionable area. And okay. you? I wonder how long this brain is going to stay fresh in your backpack. <laughs> <laughs> I'm starting to wonder if I have to do the brain for anything else. I kind of feel like that. to recover from. Can't leave oh, this card lying around. This must be uh, where I can find one of those things that you want to activate. Looks like there's a uh, current to get back a little bit more easily on the way here. That's cool. This is going to be a hard area. It's looking creepy, at least. Looks like some rails to grind. Hmm, I wonder if it takes me all the way back to the beginning. Kind of looks like it might. supposed to be here yet. Maybe I can make the jump with the levitation ball. Here we go. <laughs> Just realized I could have climbed. It's hilarious. Literally make 
I mean, what if this place? that one. Maybe I can make it from the ledge. Let's see. There we go. I nice didn't think I could. So I guess we need to try more elves. Ah oh, no! Dang it. Some progress lost. Maybe I'll do it on the way back out. That might be the best use of my time. There's a thing anyway. for sure, side blast. I think I'd be more handy than the uh, mental connection. Just zoom around and shoot some of these guys. Oh nice, okay. Let's get us a fire going too. everywhere they go. I really don't want to fall off the stage. I'm sure that's another way I can fell this team. are more work than I expected, but it looks more stable now. Okay, oh. then. There's something beyond this, but I don't know. Maybe that's just uh, the background. Okay, I guess I'll try using the rail again. Fingers crossed.
Dang, you about flung me off again. Ah. Wonder what that is. Hmm. Okay. I'll have to get out. That's probably enough. Looks like there's something up over there. Wonder how we can reach that. Aha! Uh -huh. That was cool. Thanks, little squirrel. Appreciate it, bud. <laughs> ah, I bet this is what that other part was. Um, let's go see. No, oh, no, it's all in the area. This is where the fungus is that Lily really was asking for. Ah, it's the questionable area. Okay. Guess we'll get there in just a moment. Just wanted to check just in case there's something down here to collect. It's interesting to have so much, but nothing to do. Okay then, I guess that's it. All right. <sighs> Looks like the Aquato family circus has traveled through here all right. Yep, we had to hightail it out into the woods because you're ashamed of being an Aquato. I'll stop being ashamed of that if you stop being ashamed of being a psychic. Oh, you're asking for it, Raspy. Frazy, it's okay. You can tell Dad now. You don't have to hide anymore. <sighs> this is your last warning. Frazy? <sighs> Ow! More where that came from. Everybody's always hitting on her ass. So rude. Farfetch Falls. Jeez, is this like a whole nother overworld? So you have Farfetch Falls at point A, Fiera's Fernicular, Cave of the Sasclops, Campgrounds, Lumbersack Diner, and the Forgetful Forest. And a lot to do here too, wow. And tipping. <laughs> you said no about wonder and tipping. <laughs> Practically a national park. <laughs> okay. Um, yep. Well, let's see what's in here. So maybe there's multiple ways in and out, looks like. That's cool. I wonder if there's also, truly there's one of those little manholes around here that we can use to go from one place to another. A card. Yep. I need to remember I can double jump oh. in this game. <laughs> there we go. Yoink. Hmm. Maybe I can jump over. Oh, maybe not. Maybe I can get on the axe, so. Uh, yeah, it's a rail. <laughs> nice. 
Ah. Some of those uh, things spinning around on top of that. So I wonder if I can alley oop up there. That would be really cool. Oh, I bet I can side blast that. Let's try. Try again. <laughs> I get the impression that the devs in this game really enjoyed their jobs. <laughs> Jump off before and get all the way to the world. Steps. different pieces of dialogue. We must have known this would take a few tries. treehouse from here. Maybe not. Yep. You found Bucky Fierro's questionable area. <laughs> Guess my family has chosen where to set up the Aquato Dome. I have to find one before we actually get to do anything. Ah, oh, maybe it's in here. Rebel around the bow. Oh, hey, there we go. There's our next one. Cool. Go see mom in the campgrounds. She's worried sick about you. <laughs> so hilarious. <laughs> mm. Sensing some stray thoughts around. Ah, People might go. think this thought tuner looks dorky, but I think it's cool. Must be right on the edge of it. Nope, that's not it. Hmm. I think it's the other direction. Here we go. It's gonna be popping up soon. Okay. 
Ah, oh, that's how I can get over to this one. It's gonna be that. All right. Sweet. This is too pretty to leave out here. Does that get me to anywhere near? Um, there's this tightrope. Might be able to reach it. Did I get it? I did. Sweet. Let's see, it has some grass or a vine growing on the tree. Huh, interesting. I don't see anything. Maybe it's just for the bees. Oh, it still hurt me. Thought I could do that. Maybe I did it from too high. Jerk! Every day with her could be our last. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna need that card. I'll take that card. This is this way too fine. I could explore in a world like this all day long. for some reason. Warning, the Forgetful Forest is not part of the Questionable Area Recreation Center and is not covered by our insurance policy. This sounds like the best attraction in the Questionable Area to me. This sounds cool. Let's see what else we have to do though. Farfetch Falls, okay. Guess we'll try to go meet the family. Sounds like they're at the campsite, maybe. Ooh, a funicular. I mean, who doesn't love those? Don't even think about getting on that funicular before you visit your family. Wish she just swung me away. Jeez, look at that at wheel. That dumb waterfall. Go see your family. <laughs> She's not relent. Whoa. You don't usually see this in the physical world. What a strange place. Huh. Indeed. Oh. Well, oh, there's a mess up. Thought I missed. That hole, but apparently not. I forgive you. Mom? I mean, if little children never ran away from home, where would the circus get her workers, huh? Uh, <laughs> what matters is that the Aquatos are all together again. And this little adventure of yours has actually given me fresh inspiration for our act. Me too! Did you see that unnatural and slightly gimmicky waterfall over there? The one flowing upside down? Stay away from it. No water. Too late, Nona. It has already watered the flower of inspiration in my heart and blossomed in two. Guess what I called it. Guess. The upside down waterfall? The devil's fire hose. Let's show our runaway how we do it, everybody. Creepy on the bottom. This 
would be easier if you didn't use so much hair grease. It'd be easier if your head weren't so pointy. <laughs> <laughs> now, Rasputin, up top you go. Yes, son. And then you could add a little psychic flourish by levitating this pine cone. No, no. Then we pass each person up the tower like water flowing. No psychic flourishes. I told you. We are acrobats. We don't do parlor tricks. Uh, guys? Why not a little of both? Hops. Oh, cutting. Oh, no, no. Jeez. You guys. Oh, shush. This is why we taught you how to fall as babies. <sighs> it's no use. We need the aquatodome. <laughs> I'm on it. Help him out, would you, Pooty? He's had to take on so much extra work since you abandoned your family and broke our hearts. <laughs> That's a good boy. <laughs> no guilt there. <laughs> if there's one thing the Aquatos know how to do, it's making themselves at home. Anywhere. Okay, that might be the perfect time to quit. Yeah. Okay, well, I think I'll go ahead and call that a stream. So that's quite a good set of adventures for today. So thanks for watching. It's been S Tier Rank. You follow me on Twitch and Twitter at S Tier Rank. And I will have a replay of today's stream up soon on YouTube. Have a good one.